This is the St. Joan of Arc um, Chapel in Milwaukee, of all places, believe it or not. It's this 15th century uh, chapel that was reconstructed and brought to Milwaukee. As I understand, it's a gift of this um, Mark Rotman family, as it says here. And um, it was moved here, in, I guess, in 1966. And before that, it was owned by another family in um, Long Island. See how beautiful the stained glass is in here. There's a 14th century tapestry, as I understand it here too, that's in amazingly good condition considering how old it is. Some more stained glass back here. Quite a place, you certainly don't expect it in Milwaukee. What is that stone right here? St. John of Arc was said to have kissed it before she goes to battle. It's said to be two of our little Marquettes. You're a tour guide here? Yes, I am. And you're from Wayne? Yes. I went to Villanova, so I know that area really? very well. Yes. Oh, what brings you here? I, well, we're just in Milwaukee, and I wanted to see this chapel. We oh, read about awesome. it. Do you know much about this? Uh, in here, she is the full-fledged okay. tour guide. Um, I just do the undergraduate admissions. But this is a 15th century chapel that yes. was reconstructed and moved here? Yes. I read it. Brick. And it was in Long Island before this, yes, I read? Yes, it was. That's and interesting. Here you can see some of the um, some numbers and how they pieced it together. Um, some numbers? Yeah, see how um, that's how they built back together. You can't see them on the hmm. walls because they're on like the interfaces. But they number them all, right? They number so them all. So they can get back yeah. here. And another cool thing too is like this was added over time uh, because obviously like we wouldn't fit anymore. <laughs> Which is kind of cool. Quite a place, huh? Yeah, it's, it's really nice to have right on campus. So that's cool. But in there, she knows. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Can you also 